Lyceum, my name is Nika. This is a special announcement for you from your prefects. Just a reminder that the club fair will be running from period two to three in the forum today. It's a great way to get involved in our school community, so make sure to check it out. Thanks, STM. Hey, STM, I'm Fia. And I'm Mara, and we're here from our h rage Executive Committee. Sign-ups for handing out flyers and for Halloween night will be until October 3rd in the forum from second to fourth period. Just a few clarifications about the sign-ups. Groups can only have a maximum of four people with one person designated as the group leader. When signing up, we will ask for the group leader's school email, period one and five classes, and room numbers, as well as the names of everyone in the group and their phone numbers. Also, make sure to have a designated driver that will be able to drive you for both the flyer handouts and for Halloween night. So, please come and sign up today to help support this amazing cause. If you have any questions, please let us know as soon as possible. You can find us in the forum, on lunches, or DM us on our socials at STM underscore H for H. Thanks, Thanks STM. STM. How many people can I have in my group? A minimum of two, a maximum of four, plus a driver that does not have to be a member of your group. So what am I even signing up for? You guys will be given a route to distribute flyers on, and on Halloween night, you'll go back to that same route and pick up the cans from the houses that you visited and bring them back to the cap. So when do we go and collect canned goods? Um, on Halloween? Let me double check. <laughs> So, how many hours do I get anyways? 10, as long as you complete your routes and you sign in and sign out on Halloween night. How do I sign up? You can sign up in the CAF from now until October 7th on your lunch periods. Just make sure you have the contact information of everyone in your group and the name of a driver. Why should I join Halloween for Hunger? Halloween for Hunger is the perfect way to get involved in our community and to earn a few Christian service hours. That night, we offer pizza and a live DJ. It is going to be so fun. <laughs> All proceeds from Halloween night go to neighbor to neighbor food banks. We make up approximately 10% of the food on their shelves. Thousands of people seek help from neighbor to neighbor each month, 38% of them being children. The need has never been greater. Good morning, STM. I'm Mika. And I'm Matthew. Here from your diversity committee. And your student council. Thank you to all teachers and students who participated in our orange shirts message of hope. Thank you to Mr. Marlin and Seymour team for their support in ad wall submissions, announcements, and video clips via Seymour during our week of truth and reconciliation. Finally, a huge thank you to Ms. Martras for organizing Truth and Reconciliation Week. A reminder to all period one classes that a representative from the diversity committee will be coming to, you to collect your completed orange shirt sometime this morning. Monday, September 30th is, is Orange Shirt Day to make a statement for National Day for Truth and Reconciliation. To participate, every student must donate a maximum of $1 of school cash online by this Friday night at 11 p.m. On Monday, you must wear your orange shirt and uniform bottoms. All monies raised will go directly to the support of Walnut's Cultural Center. At STM, donate and wear an orange shirt on Monday, September, on Monday, September 30th, showing that every child matters. Thanks, Thanks STM. STM. Good morning, STM. My name is Ella. And my name is Nika, and here are your announcements for today. Breakfast Club runs in the cafeteria on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays from 7.40 to 8 a.m. Stop by and grab some breakfast or snacks. With free fruit, muffins, and eggs, you'll be sure to start your day off right. Attention students, the Running for Racial 5K walk slash run is happening Sunday, September 29th, 2024, starting bright and early at 7.30 a.m. at CF Lime Ridge. This event supports an incredible initiative, and students, listen up. You can earn four Christian service hours just by participating. It's a great way to give back while getting active. Let's come together, get moving, and make a difference. See you there. And now for your sports. Yesterday on the Diamond, the baseball team hosted BR in another nail biter. With four lead changes throughout the game, the boys held on for the big win. Next game is on Tuesday. 
Congratulations to the Junior Boys Volleyball team on defeating ACMT 2-1. They showed great strength and perseverance against a tough team and crowd. Next game is Monday at 3.30 in our home gym. Thanks from Stimponi and Van Herzl. In an exciting field hockey action, your Lady Knights knocked PR to the ground, beating them 2-0. Fantastic shout-out shout out by Tara and Bianca. Goals, goal, goals were scored by Lena Jolly and Kiera Lejean. Come support your team on Monday on home turf when we play Cathedral at 2 p.m. Also, in your tournament play, your Lady Knights came out strong. Four games were played and a great day was had, including a road trip to Crumble. Goals were scored by Kira Lejean with a hat trick, Julia Fanara with two, and Kiona McCroy with one. Fantastic day, ladies. Well done. Thanks, STM. STM, those are all of your announcements for today. The time is now 8.22. And remember, it's, it's a, a great, great day, day to be a night. night.